We're here with the Premier of the BC Cancer Agency uh, announcing a further $3 million for the BC Cancer Foundation in support of research in personalized oncogenic medicine. For cutting edge, world leading research that will change the lives of cancer patients in British Columbia, across Canada, and all around the world. Believe me, the work that researchers and professionals are doing here at the Cancer Agency is having an international impact. The reality is, is that cancer centres and the best researchers around the globe are looking at British Columbia for the very latest in treatment advances, like genomic-based personalised medicines strategies that we're seeing treating cancers today. The result is that BC is ranked among the top five places in the world to be treated for cancer. It truly is an exciting time in cancer research uh, when we're seeing breakthroughs uh, in understanding of cancer translating into real improvements for patients with cancer, and you're going to hear a wonderful story about that today. After approximately a year after my diagnosis, I was approached by Dr. Laskin to participate in the POG program. So one month after starting on this drug, which is just one little pill that I take daily, I had a chest x-ray of my left lung to view the largest tumor. Amazed and shocked, the tumor had shrunk considerably. For people that in the past did not have much hope of overcoming their cancer, now with this new technology being developed and, uh, and the expertise being generated right here in British Columbia is giving them hope and it's truly amazing. So we're really happy to support that work. It puts British Columbia on the world stage. It saves lives. And it attracts the best and the brightest from around the world, which again, creates jobs. Great biotech jobs, people in the research sector, the kind of future that most of us would love to have, uh, love to see for our kids. Imagine a future where someone that you love is diagnosed with cancer, and you can sit down with them and confidently talk to them about the fact that after they've been diagnosed, their likelihood of surviving is so much higher as a result of the work that these professionals here at the BC Cancer Agency are doing. That is the future for people who will be diagnosed with cancer, and it will be a future that is shaped by people right here in British Columbia.